Welcome back, everybody. Still working on the Warm Springs Village here. And today I am going to build a candle shop. This was suggested in a comment on one of my videos by, let me uh, make sure I got the name right, uh, Po Diablo, I believe is the name of the person who suggested this. Thank you. I had not thought of a candle shop, but they suggested a banner shop. Uh, in a candle shop. So I'm going to do the candle shop. So I think I'm going to put the shop right here. I've got some of these nice new cherry planks and some other wood that I think and blocks I think would go good in the store. Oops, I don't want that one. We're just going to go with the, the wood for now. I think the door would be uh, right here. Let's see how big I want this one to do. Yeah, maybe about this big. Oh, come on. We don't need one there or there. Boy, that is really pink, isn't it? I still think we should be able to dye the wood. So like if we got oak planks, we could dye it with any of the dye colors. And it would go, you know, like it does with terracotta. It would go shade of that color. Whatever that color was combined with the color that the, the planks were. So like the spruce would be a little darker color. The oak would be a little lighter the birch would almost be the same exact color and so just just something like this an idea I had oops I don't want these I don't want the little circular thing show you know, it's like I guess I've got to put the uh, put the other ones down first boy I'm having a little trouble placing blocks again I swear I've not been drinking Maybe that's the problem. It should be. All I've had is coffee. I mean, it's the coffee that's doing it to me. Of course, if I go with like water or something, I'd be uh, probably asleep and I wouldn't be able to do this. Of course, if I drink more coffee, I'll probably get all agitated and jittery. And that's not going to work either. Where do, I don't know. Am I out of. I'm going to have to get some more. Uh, I'm going to have to get some more cherry tree blocks. Okay, well, I guess I'll get some cherry saplings and some bone meal. I know I have bone meal around here someplace, yeah. Well, we'll be growing some trees, and then uh, we'll come back and put some walls up on this thing. There we go. Picked up a few more of these. And then we'll just strip them. And that gives us a nice little pattern. Still trying to figure out what I want for the roof. Ooh, the calcite breaks easily. But for the walls, let's see, door. Yeah, door can be over there. That's not bad. We're going to go with a whitish tone, which I think will go good. I've got a bunch of calcite. Had to go, had to go looking in a few spots for this stuff because I uh, didn't have any on hand in the in this uh, town. So I had to go all the way like to Bay City and the castle and stuff, where I kind of keep stockpiles of things. And I don't have much of it. We're just going to scatter a little bit around here. So I got one more stack. So let's see, so window. Got a window there. Oh, phew. Caught, I caught that block out of the corner of my eye there, and I thought it was a creeper head. I'm thinking like, why is a creeper in my building? Window there, window there. I'm thinking I'm going to put another window 
here. Oh. And a window here. That diorite, or that uh, calcite went farther than I thought it would. There we go, nice big window back there. Okay, that's looking good, looking good, looking good. And I thought of doing pink windows, but I'm actually going to do a bunch of purple windows. Actually, not purple. I think they're magenta. It stays within the same color family, but it's not just, the, you know, not the same color. I think that helps sometimes. Let's go block these off. Looks good, looks good. Oh, I can do, I can get rid of these two. So we have our windows here. And besides just having, you know, candles are nice, but I think in addition to it, I'm going to have like some crystals and stuff in here. And then, you know, a few, you know, the candles, I guess would be, I'm going to have colored candles, but they're like aromatherapy candles. So you're going to have to, so I'll have some, you know, you're going to need flowers and that kind of stuff. I think, so I think flowers, crystals, and candles all kind of go together. It's almost like a, not so much a new age shop, but one of those, uh, I don't know, you've seen those little shops. Like if you go to the coast on vacation or something, they have these tiny little shops where they got a bunch of smelly candles or I guess scented candles are not smelly scented candles and like little crystals and little glass trinkets and stuff and all the little foo-foo stuff that well the wife goes for so that kind of stuff you mean know, it's I mean it is more for the wife or the females would go for that kind of stuff because uh, the men I guess we would be looking for like a knife shop or <laughs> something like that. Um, I mean, I use candles, but that's not the first draw if I'm looking for shopping. I, candles, usually the candles are there just to light in the bathroom or just to, you know, it's a, to light to get rid of whatever uh, scent you have in the house without having just to spray a can of something. I don't, you know, don't typically like line them up around the bathtub to take a nice bath. Although I take showers, so they wouldn't last very good because the uh, candles in the shower, I don't think they would, uh, I don't think they'd last very long. Okay, that's good. I just need to think of a roof now. Well, I went with a white roof to go with the white building. Mainly, uh, it's got some white concrete, some diorite, polished diorite. Oh, oh, I, I didn't want to do that. Um, and then on the ends, I think I'm going to do like this. Just to give it a little depth there. Like that. Um, and maybe just put, yeah, fill those blocks in. Yeah, so we have a very pink house. Yeah, I like that texture there. Because I was afraid if I just put the blocks there, it'll be really, really smooth and flat. But I think that would be okay. And I may even widen these windows up. Uh, I've got some. I know I have some more glass. Let me widen these windows up a little bit. Let in a little more light. Oh, then I need to do the back side here. My bed is dark in here. Let's let's turn that on. Oh. Yeah, I've got a little bit of darkness, and I don't know what's lighting up over here. It must be must be some torches out there. Let's get rid of those. Yeah, let's get rid of these torches. 
We don't want a false sense of security. I need to give her the snow too. Yeah, okay, so here, I think I can put, does that touch it? No, it doesn't. Oh, come on. Why, why are you being like that? Get off of there. Okay, so it didn't stay on that one. Maybe if I do that. Okay, that lights this up. And then in here, no, do that and that. Okay. Okay, so it's lit. We won't have any creepers showing up in here. So this corner over here is going to be the cashierish place. So I'm going to do this, um, this, and this. And, oh, there we go. So I got a little tally book. I'm going to put that there. Ooh, I like the ding, and that like that. And then, like in the corner, I'm just going to put like a little. I don't know if it's a chair or what that is. But I don't like it. No, I can't do that either. Eesh. Maybe like that. Yeah, I guess that'll have to do. Okay, so that is our corner. Um, I'm gonna. Do I have? I do have this. Well, no, I don't. I'm gonna do this. I'm going to pay like a big crystal there because that's kind of like a advertising thing or a impulse shopping buy. You can buy that giant crystal if you're in here. So now I need to lay out the rest of the walls. And of course, I did not bring the blocks I need, but luckily they're right over here. So I've got some uh, quartz. I've got lots of quartz. I've got a lot of candles too, so we'll put those in there. So let's do, I'm going to put like that. It's a very nice, bright, shiny place here, so I kind of like that. And we'll put, I'm going to do that there. Actually, put two of those right there. And uh, let's see, maybe this here. And I do need, I do need some more of those slabs. We'll just put that there. It's not going to be, I'm not going to have any, uh, I guess I, I brought the crafting table, but I don't think I've got any uh, space for it. It really doesn't fit with the decor in here. Oh, well, speaking of decor, I don't know if that has anything to do with decor. But there. Yeah, that looks better. So we have our little checkout area here. Let's put a little. Oh, that's too big of a painting. That's too big. Too big of a painting. Oh, I kind of like that one. Ooh, I do. I do like that one. Very artistic. Very artistic. And it kind of goes with the, the, the vibe I'm having here. The vibe. Let's go there. So we got a nice long table here. And then I think... A little table here. That looks good. And then maybe another little table here. Doesn't have to be too big. Oh, that's not good. Where's my crafting table? Somehow, I was trying to figure out how eight slabs disappeared, so, or eight stairs disappeared so. But 
I remember I put one over here. I was trying to figure out how did I get an odd number? Maybe something like that. There, we got plenty of room around everything. Now I just need to put some merchandise. Let's get this. No. Uh, yeah, that kind of looks good. Oh, maybe that one too. I'm trying the new ones. We're putting the new ones in. That's a little too big. Yeah, that's a little too big. Um, yeah, we'll do that. A lot of paintings on the wall. Oh, is I going to make that big? I don't need... Okay, I'm not going to make that bigger. Because I think that works out good with the layout in here. Okay, so I got some candles. These are all like scented uh, blueberry, sage, um, that's like uh, deep woods or some kind of musk or some one of those weird scents right there. And I've got some normal candles too. Oh, and some crystals. that crystals would go good in this uh, this type of store because you see all like you know, little knickknacks and little uh, all that kind of stuff I thought that would there I think that there we go I got a candle shop oh I can light these candles too so they're not gonna burn down so I'll light I'll light them up Mmm. Ah, can't you smell the aroma? The aromatherapy going on with all the different scented candles. Can you just see the, the healthy aroma just coming off? The healthy scent in the air. Ah, smell that. Yes. Yes, it's a candle shop. So we have our candle shop. Um, let me, uh, I'm just going to put chest. Well, chest, uh. Chest, the chest would go here, won't it? There. Let's put our wicks in there. Oh, yes, I had. Since it's aroma therapy stuff, you're going to have like flowers and herbs around. But I didn't leave much room for them, did I? I'll just put some like flowers there. Maybe a little herb pot here. Yeah, I think that'll be okay. Here, I'll just do this. Here, I think, I think the candles look better when they're bunched up into multiples. They look, the singles aren't bad, but I think the multiples do look better. Plus, that gives me room to put some more of these, like, plant decorations here. Let's do this. I'm going to do, pop this one off and put the plant over here. Oh no! The grass won't grass won't go into my uh, my flower pot. How come that won't? Everything should go into a flower pot, I'd say. So what do I have? I have one of these funny little things and a little flower, a little flower. Um... There's got to be a flower. Oh, there, we've got a little red one. There. That should do it. And there we go. We have our candle shop. Candle and crystals and other kind of other stuff to make your house nice and livable and not stink like a like a bachelor pad. Although, if you are a bachelor in a bachelor pad, I do recommend getting scented candles and burning them because that will freshen up your house, especially if you got uh, your girlfriend coming over or your potential girlfriend. Uh, although, you can buy your potential girlfriend is more definitely definitely put candles and get the place unstinky if you're bringing over a potential girlfriend. If you already got the girlfriend, you can be a little more lax because once you got them on the hook, um, you're caught. So, good luck at getting away from them. 
But anyhow, that is it for today. I want to thank you all for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.